Welcome to Over the Years. My name is Tim, and I love vintage items. I hunt for treasures and bring you the ultimate prizes of antiques, collectibles, and vintage decor. Join me, my dukes, my girlfriend Josie, and other guests as we search for history. Hello. Welcome, everybody. Sorry for the late start. Um, we, we, we were missing a few key uh, things, the flashlight and the ruler, uh, but they have been located, and we are here. I'm alive, believe it or not. Josie, how are you? I'm well. I'm just looking for Ace. Ace, come here, boo-boo. <laughs> so thank you everybody for joining us this evening we have 31 people here already make sure you guys hit that uh thumbs up while you're here and we'll give uh, ace a little screen time really fast ace say hello to the people say hi boo boo <laughs> ace he's looking for you All right, so if this is your first time here. This is Over the Years, and this is our live vintage sale. We have a whole bunch of items for you guys tonight, a lot of really cool stuff. We're super excited to uh, show you guys what we have available this evening. Uh, so will Ace be in the wedding? I don't know. That's a good question, Josie. Yes, he has to be incorporated into the wedding somehow, but... My mom says he's going to bring the ring. She's right next to me. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Big shout out to the homie Waterfly. I really appreciate it. Thank you very much for the $20 super chat. He says, not coffee or $9.99. So for those of you that don't know on, this football, on my football channel, anytime somebody sends a, nine, a, a super chat ending in 99 cents, I do this whole thing where it's, 9.99. So big shout out to Waterfly. It says not coffee or 9.99, but well deserved and goes towards the wedding. We really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you, uh, Walter. This is your first time here. The angel. This is my fiance, uh, Josie. Josie, meet Walter. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so um, the way I guess. Let me say some hellos to the people in the chat, and then we'll go over the rules and regulations. First in the room, my man, what's going on? Chubby Uncle Rico. Shout outs uh, to my man, Jeremy. Sod supporter. Can't thank him enough for everything that he does. I really appreciate you more than you can imagine. And uh, Nancy Dukes in the building. I'm sure everybody's going to have, because so I accidentally say this uh, piece that we found in the um and with me and my dukes and i was reading the bottom and like you know i was super tired and you know i like to say things my own way so i said blue danube and it's apparently that's not how you say it it's blue danube danube <laughs> but i said blue danube so i'm pretty sure everybody's going that's going to be the new thing now <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> big shout out to carrie casey addicts our favorite comedian on youtube and Angela Marksberry is in the building. What's going on, Angela? Thank you for joining us, as always. Make sure you guys are supporting Angela. She does so much for the community. She puts out the vintage calendar every week. She also has been making merchandise. Uh, so definitely want to show some love to Angela. We really appreciate everything that you do. Sue Powell's in the building. What's going on, Sue? My man Steve, back alley trash and treasures, TNT, Dynamite. What's going on, brother? Thank you for joining us. And the lovely Pam is in the building. What's going on, Pam? How are you? And Tree is me. Hello, hello. Junk Girl Patty's in the building. Junk Girl Patty has been she she gets a lot of good stuff. I see I see what you're doing on Instagram, Junk Girl Patty. You're taking care of business. The lovely Trisha from San Diego, another one you guys have to make sure you're subscribed to. She has amazing live sales. So big shout out to Trisha over at San Diego. Sue Golombeski's in the building. What's going on, Sue? And we also have Tammy, Tammy Renee Walker. Hello, hello. Lynn Dowdy is in the building. What's going on, Lynn? 
the absolutely amazing and always wonderful Michelle is here as well. Lori, the blue flamingo mercantile. What's going on, Lori? Judy, Judy Scallett is here. And Dana, Grace 2010H, says, glad Josie is here tonight. She's always a little worried if Josie doesn't show up immediately. Well, it's still going to be an amazing show if I'm not around. Yeah, but I mean, I'm not as pretty to look at as you are, so. Oh, come on. <laughs> Andrea Kane is in the building. What's going on, Andrea? Thank you for joining us. Sheila is here. Hey, Sheila Putman. Thank you for stopping by as always. CJ Bailey. Hello, CJ Bailey. Thank you for joining us. Who else we have in here? We have Christine. Thank you for joining us, Christine. We appreciate it. Irene is here. The three halls from the weekend were fabulous. Thank you very much, Irene. So for those of you, if you have not seen um, the three video haul series, we picked up over 300 pieces of glass, porcelain, ceramic this weekend. We put out three videos. So make sure you guys check out those three videos at some point. And if you see something in those videos that you want to see in the live sale auction uh, next week, which is going to be our first of two wedding uh, auction and live sale. So basically what we're doing is, is everything that we make in the live sale next week will go towards um, our wedding. So thank you guys, as always, for the support. Proud American is in the building. What's going on, Proud American? And on a, let's see if I missed anybody else. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I fell asleep for a little bit. I'm not going to lie. Julie Schwartz. Hey, guys, what a major haul. Awesome finds. Josie and her mom did an amazing job. Yes, they they definitely killed it for sure. Thank you. Maria is in the building, and there it is. Hashtag Blue Danube. <laughs> Uh, Mary Cox. Yes, I got your email. Uh, I was going to reply back to you before the live, but I fell asleep. Um, I will not forget to send you an email as soon as, uh, I wrap up the live sale for sure. Thomas Lynch is here. Thank you, Thomas, for stopping by. Anthony Bluegrass Picker, another one of my favorite channels. The guy doesn't just resell. He plays the guitar. He said his antique mall is having a Fenton Day coming up soon, which Ooh. is super interesting. Connie Ainsley is in the building. And Cricket Harrington, Chris is here. So got my package of my beautiful horses. I'm super glad to hear. Barb Lee is in the building. What's going on, Barb? Thank you for stopping by. <laughs> Uh, the, I don't know what the cuddle, cuddler's jar is. Which which uh, which thing you were saying is a cuddler's jar? I don't I don't I wasn't sure what that was. You have to uh tell me what because I don't know what a cuddler's jar is. So let me know. I I saw the message. I totally forgot though. And Waterfly coming through with another five dollars super chat, my man. I appreciate it. Thank you very Thank much. You. This towards the wedding, also super awesome. Really appreciate it. All right, we got fifty nine people, sixty people now watching between Facebook and YouTube. If you are watching on Facebook and you want to get on the action, make sure you head over to YouTube to um, drop your bids. Uh, Sal, my man, Sal, the best tape dispenser designer in the world <laughs> he's got an etsy store sal drop that link in the chat when you get a chance if you guys wanted some custom uh tape dispensers he's your guy he's we're gonna awesome. need one yeah we definitely gotta get some uh sal i do have a couple of glowing pieces tonight in the live sale so are there any pieces that i grabbed that are in the sale tonight yeah uh, I, I, it all kind of blends together. Okay. I, I think there might be a few, but I saved most of what you grabbed for the wedding sale. Cause it's just, it's, I mean, it, it's so like when I tell you guys that we have just have 300 plus items that arrived overnight, it's not even exaggeration. Like there's literally, and I kept stuff for myself. Did Josie pull her stuff out? I did. I did, luckily. Good, and I was looking at those glasses. And I was thinking, man, I, I, these can't go in the dishwasher. She don't want to have these. They cannot go into the microwave. They cannot go into the dishwasher. But it's okay. It's worth it. I'm only interested in Josie's picks, says David. 
<laughs> All right. So the way that this will work is as follows. So basically we have curated in a large amount of items that we are going to offer for sale this evening. The way that it works is we will show you an item. And then once we show you that item, we will show you a card. There will be a price on that card. And once we remove this, there will be a number. The first person to type this number in the chat will win this item for $9. Now, remember, it is the first person that Josie sees in her chat because sometimes there's a difference in what you see and what we see because of internet lags and, and other uh, variables. <clears throat> Excuse me. So make sure that you keep it on live chat and refresh if you have to. Um, do remember that we are shipping from the state of Maryland, but we do do our best to make sure that we keep your shipping costs as low as possible without sacrificing the safety and integrity of your purchase. <clears throat> um, is there anything else? Oh, yeah. You have to make sure that you put in the right number. Um, that way there's no confusion. It uh, transposed. It doesn't count. Yes. And so if... Uh, there's something else I want to say, and you just totally threw me off my train of thought. Um, I can't remember. I think that's it. Is there anything else I'm missing, Josie? No. Well, no. Okay. Uh, and also, we basically everything that is here, nothing here is listed. This is all you guys are getting the first opportunity to to purchase these items before I would have listed them on eBay, Etsy, or Macari. Uh, so we do try to give you guys a price that is anywhere between 20% and 50% less than what we would list these items for on eBay, Etsy, or Macari. Mm -hmm. uh, so the, I think grailed. Well, grailed is only clothing. Oh, okay. is on. My deuce is on one already. <laughs> All right. Well, you guys in the chat ready to rock and roll? I think we're ready to get this show on the road. And also, if anybody has any questions at any point in time, Please do not hesitate. Um, just uh, put it in the chat, and we will get to it as soon as possible. Actually, I think the first thing up is from your uh, your um, picking, Josie. Oh, yeah? Oh. <clears throat> what is it? All right. Got two things from Josie. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the live sale is officially underway. The first item up is going to be this absolutely gorgeous marigold carnival glass basket. Now, as far as the maker goes of this basket, I'm not 100% sure. It could be – some people say it's Fenton, but Fenton isn't really known for you know producing much marigold. Um, it could also be Imperial, Dugan glass. Uh, this is like one of those molds that got passed around through a lot of different glass companies. But you can see it is absolutely gorgeous. And the way that it reflects off on the light is fabulous. It's just a really pretty color. Um, it's in really good shape. It does have a little bit of, of rough edges and some like one place on the handle. It's a little. Right there, as you can see. But besides that, it is in fabulous condition. And like I said, it is just absolutely gorgeous. The way that it hits the light is fabulous. Uh, it does, yes. It does measure at the top of the handle to be about a pinch under six inches tall. And they're saying hi to Josie's mom. <laughs> and it can be yours. For the absolutely low price of only $13, if you give me number 17. Number 17 for $13 gets you this absolutely gorgeous marigold carnival glass basket. And boy, is it a beaut. Look at the way that that shines. Absolutely gorgeous. Over time. All right. Congratulations to Rachel Hay. Oh. 
Rachel, hey, winner, winner. Merry Gold Basket Dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. They said Josie and her mom look like sisters. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen. Kitty Vintage is in the building. Hello, Kitty Vintage. Thank you for joining us. Speaking of Kitty, we have this beauty right here. So this is a really interesting piece. And you can see the design on the front is a looks like a couple riding ducks, which is super interesting. But even cuter is the kitty cat creeping over into the creamer. And that is the handle. How adorable is this? <laughs> so you have the spotted cat and you have the couple riding ducks. I mean, that's fairly unique. And it is made in Japan as marked on the bottom of the creamer. Carissa says we need shirts that say welcome to the party. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna we're gonna put out a whole merchandising line as soon as we get out into this new our new house when we have time to do that. So it measures to be three and three fourths inches at its tallest point, which is the cat's ears. But I just thought that this was super adorable and absolutely old, I think. it has definitely got some age for sure. Absolutely. And it can be yours for the low price of only $9 if you give me number 19. Number 19 for $9 gets you the couple riding ducks with the cat handle creamer. An absolute beaut. Congratulations to Thomas Lynch. Congratulations, Thomas. Winner, winner. Man and woman riding ducks dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. I'll just grab from there. All right. Up next, we have another gorgeous piece of marigold carnival glass. Now, this pattern is actually fairly difficult to find in certain pieces. Um, this is part of the berry bowl set. So what would happen is you'd have one giant bowl and then you'd have um, anywhere between six and eight of these little bowls that people would put berries in or any sort of fruit or snack, uh, things of that nature. Now this is made by Jeanette Glass and the name of the pattern is commonly referred to as crackle. So it almost looks like uh, kind of like a crackle glass, but not really, or, they're like uh, veins almost is what it looks like in the bottom of the bowl. If I can get it to focus. There you go. Very cute. And it has these sort of scalloped edges um, going around the bowl. Let's try one more time to see if I can get you guys a better view of that. There you go. And you can see it is very, very pretty. And this bowl, so typically, I guess, you know, this bowl would probably be, I would probably list this for around $15. Uh, and it is about four and a quarter inches wide and about an inch and a quarter tall. And this can be yours for the low price of only $9 if you give me number 20. Number 20 for $9 gets you the Jeanette Carnival Glass Marigold Crackle Vein Berry Bowl. Whoa, Ace. Number 20 for $9 gets you the Jeanette Glass Crackle Vein Marigold Bowl. time <clears throat> okay Camel. oh we're going back and forth okay all right next up oh you know what ay 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 
Congratulations to Proud American. <sighs> winner, winner, crackle glass dinner. Congratulations, Proud American. Says, I'll put some nuts in that. Yes. <laughs> Great nut dish. Up next is this absolutely stunning crackle glass top hat. So this was probably made by Blanco or one of those West Virginia glass companies. I personally have seen a lot of top hats in my day, but I've never seen one in crackle glass. I mean, it is absolutely gorgeous. And the brim is so nice. It looks like blown glass. It is blown glass. I mean, that the, the brim really looks like blown glass. Does it have a pontel? Like, what? It yeah, yeah, yeah. My Dukes is just on one tonight. Absolutely stunning piece here. Nice. Very, very nice. <clears throat> and at its tallest point, it measures to be two and a half inches. And this crackle glass amber i mean look at that color too it's like a gorgeous honey caramelized sugar as i like to say gorgeous color crackle glass top hat can be yours for the low price of only 11 dollars if you give me number 31 number 31 for 11 dollars gets you the crackle glass amber top hat caramelized sugar an awesome, awesome, awesome piece. Not a lot of these out there. Hand blown, crackle glass top hat. Congratulations to Pam's eclectic place. Congratulations, Pam. Winner, winner, top hat dinner. Welcome to the party. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure this piece is going to be a special one for everybody in the chat. Look at this amazing piece here. So here we have a made in Japan luster elephant with the tie and polka dot shirt. Oh man, this thing tonight is doing it. There it goes. It can be a trinket dish, it can be an ashtray, but I mean, I just have never seen anything like this before. It is quite unique and very awesome. Look at that. And it is says made in Japan on the bottom, but it is not a uh, marking. It is engraved into the bottom of the dish. It is an absolutely amazing piece. And it's it, it, the interesting part too, is that like, it's kind of like squared, like lined out. Like it has adds all the texture to it. Really nice job. Yeah. And you can see the elephant's arms are like right here and right here. Super rad piece. And it can be yours. Oh, let me give you a quick measurement. It's not very big. Uh, tallest point is about one and three fourths inches. And then it is about four inches by two and a quarter inches. <laughs> it can be yours <laughs> for the low price of only $13 if you give me number 32. Number 32 for the Lusterware Deco Elephant. Congratulations to Pam's Eclectic Place. <laughs> winner, winner, Art Deco Elephant Dinner. Congratulations and welcome back to the party, Pam. Pam's got fast internet. Okay. Yeah, that was a that was a steal of a deal for the people. That was a mod Duke's price. Um, we're gonna go back to the Art Deco luster. Check out this bad boy. Oh, so this man. is a Art Deco lusterware shaker. 
which I picked up. <laughs> My Dukes wants to let everybody know that she found this piece. Okay. So we have this absolutely gorgeous flower on the center. And it is like a green and like a almost like a very pale yellow. And it is just super art deco. And then you have the orange on the top. And it is made in Japan. Now that marking is a specific marking, which is attributed to Toshiro Shoten, who was active before World War II all the way up until 1954. So this is definitely super vintage. And you can actually, a lot of the made in Japan stuff can be hard sometimes to break down into a specific maker. But because of the specific marking accompanied by the made in Japan, I can tell you exactly who made it. And this is an absolutely amazing piece. Now this shaker measures to be about five and three fourths inches tall. And I'm going to give it to you guys for a steal of a deal. I hope you guys are ready for this one. Only $13 if you give me number 29. <clears throat> number 29 for $13 gets you the Art Deco Lusterware Made in Japan Toshiro, Toshiro Shoten Shaker. And Congratulations to Andrea Kane. Andrea Kane, you are the winner. Winner, winner to Shiro Shoten Dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right, all right, all right. We're moving right along, ladies and gentlemen. Next up, we have super mid-century modern. So this is a all gold sugar caddy. So this is something you'd put your sugar packets in. Um, I'm sure there's, you know, with anything like this, you can do a lot with it. But this is made by Hall Golden Glow. Or it's made by Hall China, but the name of the color is called Golden Glow. Um, it is made in USA. It also has the number down there, 716. This is a super awesome piece. I mean, so this, for those of you that don't know, this is, you know, ceramic, pottery, porcelain, but uh, it has that gold paint all around. And there is no, no wear to any of the gold. I mean, it's got a little bit of wear, but no, nothing that's like whiting it through. It is absolutely amazing. Hollywood Regency. All right. The sugar caddy measures to be two and a half inches tall, and it is three ah. and a half by two and three fourths. And this mid century modern Hall China Golden Glow sugar caddy can be yours for the low price of only nine dollars if you give me number 22. Number 22 for the Hall China Mid-Century Modern Golden Glow Sugar Caddy. An awesome piece here. <clears throat> Congratulations to Steve, Back Alley Trash and Treasure. Winner, winner, sugar dinner. Congratulations to Steve at Back Alley Trash and Treasures. You are the winner and welcome to the party. 78 people in the chat from Facebook and YouTube. Make sure you guys hit that thumbs up. We always appreciate it. Where did I grab that from? Which side? I don't know. <clears throat> Probably this side. I think I got it from that side. All right. Next up is one of kind of my favorite uh, items here. And this is a antique. So this is over a hundred years old. This is a glass baby booty and it is in the amber color. As you can see, it is absolutely gorgeous and in a very nice color. <laughs> so you can see the details on the side of the boot, which is like the diamond quilted. 
And then it has the like crossover on the front of the boot, and it has a little bow right there. It also has the hollow bottom in the front of the boot. Uh, this, I believe, was made by Dugan. It is a baby booty, an amber glass baby booty. This one dates, yeah, <clears throat> these are hard to come by. This one dates probably from like anywhere from the 1890 to like 1915, 1920, somewhere in that time period. Uh, an absolutely amazing piece of glass history there. And it can be yours for an absolutely low, low price of only $13 if you give me number 18. Number 18 for $13 is the Amber Glass Baby Booty. You have to stop saying that before Josie announces it. <laughs> Congratulations to Sandy Otto. <clears throat> Congratulations to Trisha over at Sandy Auto. You are the winner. Winner, winner, baby booty dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. <laughs> My Duke's over here talking about this is so pretty. <clears throat> Next up, we have this art glass penguin. Uh, the maker is unknown. It does have a polished bottom, and it is an absolutely gorgeous piece. It's almost kind of difficult to show you how pretty it actually is. But it does have the white on the bottom, and then it kind of goes up into the black here. Um, I suppose you could use this as a paperweight or just as a, you know, nice figurine. And it does have a little tail in the back, the beak there. Really nice work as far as the art glass goes. It is awesome. <laughs> What's going on, Bill? How you doing, brother? <laughs> and so this art glass penguin... Measures to be approximately five inches tall, and it can be yours at a low. Can you turn it upside down? Yes. Here is the bottom. It does have the polished base here. So it was blown, but it looks like the base has been polished. So it can sit up straight. Yeah, so it can sit straight. And it can be yours for the absolutely low price of only $19, which is crazy because I would probably list this for a lot of money just because it's the art glass penguin. Can be yours if you give me number 24. Number 24 for $19 gets you the art glass penguin. Congratulations to Andrea Kane. Congratulations, Andrea. I can't. Yeah, I know, my dukes. I'm not going to say penguin dinner. Winner, winner, paperweight dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. Next up, it's time. Coo, coo. It's an owl. We guys know you love your owl. So I found this awesome owl. Look at that. I love the colors on there. So this owl is actually hand-carved alabaster from Italy, and it is marked with a sticker on the bottom. Genuine alabaster, hand-carved, made in Italy. <laughs> wow, Dukes is crazy. No laughing at me. I know you are. <laughs> And it measures to be about a pinch under two and a half inches. And this hand-carved alabaster owl can be yours for a stunning low price of only $9 if you give me number 30. Number 30 for $9 gets you the hand-carved alabaster owl made in Italy. 
Congratulations to Casey Addicts. You are the winner. Winner, winner, alabaster dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party, Casey Addicts. <clears throat> All right, ladies and gentlemen. Next up, we have... <laughs> Bill said, that's a rush of 30s. Wow. <laughs> ay, 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 Ace. You guys know it. Like, whenever Ace, so Ace is a, is a, is a, a Morky, right? So he, he's a cross between, you know, two different dogs. And they have, like, super senses. So, like, if Ace hears anything, like, remotely close to somebody coming inside the door or parking outside it is just like bah! so he's the best guard dog in the world in my opinion but some others might not think so <laughs> he really is he is right all right next up we have some absolute beauty ladies and gentlemen pink milk glass i don't know how well the pink is coming in through the screen but yes this is Pink milk glass, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely gorgeous. So they are cornucopias. And they are a pair. And remember, they are, excuse me, they are pink milk glass. Um, these are made by Jeanette Glass Company. And you are going to get the pair. You get both of these. They measure to be... About four and three fourths inches tall, and that's a cornucopia day plenty. Are you selling the knot tonight? No, Rachel, the knot will not be in tonight's live sale. There is a lot of interest in that knot. The knot will probably be going in, is definitely going to be going in next week's uh, wedding uh, sale to help raise money for Josie and I's wedding. So yes, very, very pretty pink milk glass, pair of cornucopias. Like I would think you could put these like on the end of a mantle, you know, yeah, one on each end of the mantle, bookshelf. I mean, there's a lot of decorating possibilities with these. And the pink is just slight enough where the contrast of color would work with anything, blue, um red black i mean it, it's it's gorgeous so you get the pair of pink milk glass cornucopias uh by Jeanette glass can be yours for a crazy low price of only 17 dollars if you give me number 25 number 25 for 17 dollars gets you not just one pink cornucopia but two pink cornucopias Two pink milk glass cornucopias for only $17. Congratulations to Pete's Repeats. Pete in the building. Congratulations, Pete. You are the winner, 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 cornucopia dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. Yeah, they are very, very pretty. Um, I saw a question in here. Will you be doing a preview video or live for the auction items? Yes. We will definitely um, still do our typical uh, afternoon preview show for the live sale of the um, for next week's uh, auction live sale. Um, and we'll give you guys more details on Instagram as well. So make sure you guys are following us on Instagram um, at Over the Years Collecting. Uh, and at over the years eBay on Instagram, and you'll see a whole bunch of information for the upcoming live sale, which will be one week from today. Also, if you go back and watch any one of the last three haul videos that we put out in the last uh, two, three days, then if you see an item in one of those videos that you want to see in the live sale next week, just leave a comment in the, under that YouTube video, and we will add that item to the live sale for you. All right. Where did I grab that from? That side, right? Right. Okay. Next up, we have this amazing. So it's going to be very difficult for you guys to see, but this bottle is purple. Um, it is made by the Clevenger Brothers, and it is 
a bitters bottle kind of sort of thing, reproduction in the oh man, if you I wish you could see the purple because it is absolutely gorgeous. It is a deep, deep purple. You can kind of see it right there a little bit. But on the front of the bottle, it says lemon balm. And on the back of the bottle, it says lemon balm uses iced tea, hot tea. Oh, anti-spasmodic, anti-spasmatic potpourri. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, mother. <laughs> potpourri. Potpourri. <laughs> potpourri. Not even poopery, but potpourri. <laughs> it is absolutely gorgeous. This really tall purple bottle. I love the top too. Has that old school. Four five jumps in with a pot. <laughs> and it can be yours. I mean, I'm sorry. It measures to be nine and a half <laughs> inches tall. And it can be yours for a low price of only $11 if you give me number five. Julie Schwartz says, here we go with the words. <laughs> Absolutely gorgeous deep purple bottle here. Congratulations to Tree Is Me. Tree Is Me. Winner, winner, lemon balm and potpourri dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Next up, we have one of the most beautiful items of the evening. It is this beautiful pink, and we've, we've decided we're going to call it a potion bottle. Um, it does have the stopper, and the stopper itself is just it's fabulous. Like a big piece of morganite. My Duke says it looks like a big piece of morganite. I love the shape of it, and it is an absolutely stunning pink bottle. It does have, you know, wear around the uh, here because of the stopper, but that is, I mean, this just is a little. It's a little uh, foggy right now from when it was cleaned. I have to get in there with a towel. Yeah. It is absolutely stunning. Just the shape of it. It's almost like a pink Hershey kiss turned into a bottle. What's going on, Glenn? Thanks for stopping by. But it is an absolute beauty. I mean, just look at the shape of that. And it is optic, so it does have some optics on the bottle for sure. And I will give you the measurements with the stopper in. With the stopper in, it measures to be four and three fourths inches. So this absolutely gorgeous pink glass potion bottle, and I'll show you, I really love the top too. It's almost like a colonial hat shape. Very gorgeous. And this can be yours for an absolutely steal of a deal. Low price of only $25 if you give me Number 21. Number 21 for this gorgeous pink glass potion bottle. Absolutely beautiful, stunning piece. Congratulations to Cricket Harrington. Winner, winner, potion bottle dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. Um, doo, doo, doo. so I grabbed that from where from over there, right? Yeah, all right. Next up, we have um, this is an absolutely gorgeous piece of acro agate. Uh, for those of you that don't know, acro agate made these uh child sets. Uh, they came in all different colors. This one is like a jade color. Uh, it's a little bit deeper than a jadeite, but it is opalescent. You can see the light shine through on the sides of this. It's absolutely gorgeous. I love this piece very much. Um, 
and it definitely has the Art Deco handle here. So this is a cup from a child set made by Acro Agate, and it is in the green jade color. And it does have lines on the side here, as you can see. And, oh, no, it does not glow, Judy. I wouldn't show you guys anything that glows without asking to show the glow, so. <laughs> no, I did I did not get to eat. Uh, I don't know how that got started. How that winter, winter dinner thing started. <laughs> Hey, Patricio, what's going on, brother? How are you, sir? Hope Hi, Patricio. All right, so you can get this Acro Agate Jadeite Jade colored glass. This is glass for those of you that don't know. It can be yours for the low price of only $7 if you give me number 12. Number 12 for $7 gets you the Acro Agate Art Deco Child's Set Cup in the Jade color. Congratulations to Sandy Otto. <clears throat> Congratulations, Trisha. Winner, winner, Acro Agate Dinner. Congratulations and welcome back to the party. That'd be cool to have a whole set of it and have the little dishes and everything. Yeah. We used to have a lot of them, but I sold yeah, a lot sold of it. <clears throat> All right. Next up, ladies and gentlemen, is Pure Cobalt Blue Beauty. Here we have an amazing pair of cobalt blue candlesticks. And, man, it is just not doing it justice here. Look at the beauty of this cobalt blue. It won't focus. All right, here we go. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. There you go. That's better. Beautiful cobalt blue candlesticks. Very nice shape. Paneled all the way around. Absolutely gorgeous. This is a, this is like pure cobalt blue here. No lightness to it at all. It's yeah. Like very Beautiful. deep cobalt blue. Absolutely gorgeous. I did show it from the bottom, yeah. And these measure to be four and a quarter inches tall. And you get the pair of absolutely stunning, great lines, Cobalt blue candlesticks. I mean, when you see these in the light, it's going to blow your mind. I'm looking at them from my end as the light shines towards me. God, they're gorgeous. You get the pair for an absolutely stunning low price of only $15 if you give me number 28. Number 28 for $15 gets you a pair of absolutely divine cobalt blue candlesticks. Congratulations to Steve, Back Alley Trash and Treasure. Congratulations, Steve. You are the winner, 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 cobalt blue dinner. Congratulations, my man, and welcome back to the party. All right. Hey, Jennifer Lab Mama, how you doing? Next up, we have this, uh, what we believe to be Italian. This is almost like an Italian hobnail is what I usually refer to it as. It has these very distinct, um, different variation of hobnails, sizes, shapes, um, all throughout the piece. It is a very beautiful um, honey caramelized sugar color. Um, I love how the hobnails even run all the way up to the lip on the pitcher. It, it has a really gorgeous handle, too, as you can see. Uh, fabulous piece. Absolutely stunning. I really like that. Sugar hello, Sugar Tots. My Dukes wants me to say hello. Where are you going? <laughs> all right. It measures to about five and three-fourths inches tall. And this can be yours 
for the absolute low price of only $13 if you give me number eight. Number eight for $13 gets you the Italian hobnail pitcher in that beautiful caramelized sugar color. Congratulations to Susan. <laughs> Congratulations, Susan Wehi. You are the winner. Winner, winner. Hobnail dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. If this is your first time here, don't forget that when you win your items, either immediately following or at the end of the live, you email us your YouTube name, PayPal information, and your mailing address to the email scrolling across the bottom of the screen. It should also be pinned comment at the top in the YouTube uh, chat, just so everybody knows. Congratulations, Susan. You are the winner. Okay. Next up, we have this absolutely gorgeous ruby red art glass what I believe, according to what some people said during the live preview show, to be a 1960s cigar ashtray made by Murano. It does have the blown glass mark on the bottom. I mean, you talk about gorgeous red, and this is the picture you will see in the dictionary or Pictionary because – this is a gorgeous picture. Look at that color. Look at the shape. I mean, this is just pure, absolute beauty. And this bad boy, at its tallest point, is... About two and a half inches. Murano would have smooth bottom. So if it's not, that's that's how yeah. No it, it's it's not um it does feel maybe Blanco was my initial thought. When I said when I showed it during the live sale, I thought it was Blanco. Somebody said that they thought it was no. 1960s Murano. So I I think it my initial read thought was Blanco, and that's what I said when I first showed it, but I mean, it has the the pawn tail, but it's not necessarily – it's not rough. It's kind of it, – it's smoothed out except for one spot. Feel right there. It's not bad. Yeah. So it is up to you guys what you decide to attribute it to. But it could be Blanco. It could be Murano. It could be Czech. It could be any of those three. And But it can be yours no matter what it is. For the low price of only $19, if you give me number 26. Number 26 for $19 gets you this absolutely gorgeous ruby red ashtray by Belenko or Murano or Czechoslovakian. Congratulations. Well, where's Josie? You're muted. She's frozen. Congratulations, Nancy Duke. Congratulations, Nancy Duke. You are the winner, 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 Ruby Red Dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. Next up, we have this. Hazel Atlas, I believe, was the maker of this. Um, it is like a pail, and it is an ashtray. You have the um good night angela have a great night you have the uh ashtray right here on the front of the pail and it my does mom have... grabbed that one. Oh yeah yeah <laughs> oh the moms and it has a nice like sort of like um textured uh glass in between the lines there it is a coal bucket there you go trius me coal bucket and it's absolutely super rad ashtray. Uh, it does measure to be about two inches tall. 
and it can be yours for the low price of only $9 if you give me number 11. Number 11 for $9 gets you the avocado green cold bucket ashtray. Super rad piece. In Uber time? Yes. All right. So this next piece, what's going on, Brad? Checking in from Australia. Brad and Jazz, two Aussie thrifters. If you guys are not familiar with the two Aussie thrifters, they are absolutely amazing, and I highly suggest that you guys subscribe to their channel. Absolutely amazing people, and they put out great content. So a big shout-out to Brad and Jazz, the two Aussie thrifters. All right, next up, you guys might recognize this piece. This piece was in the sale last week, but unfortunately, um, the winner never contacted me, so it is back up for sale in tonight's auction. It is this absolutely gorgeous piece of art glass. It is this purple on the top, and as you bring it around and show the bottom, it is like a ice blue. So it is like purple, smoke, ice blue dish. I mean, the colors on this are absolutely amazing. It is just a fabulous piece of artwork. Just nothing like it. And it does have slots, so it probably could be a um, ashtray. Is And it did have one... I thought it had like a little... I can never find it every time I want to talk about it. Was it on the top? Yeah. Oh. It has a little tiny flake right there. So just so everybody knows. Yeah, they told – I mean, this is an absolutely gorgeous piece, and somebody is going to be fortunate. As you can see, it is purple up top, and as it comes down, you get that blue, ice blue on the bottom. I mean, it is just absolutely gorgeous. And it's a steal of a deal too. So the widest point um, from side to side is nine inches. And then from the other side is five and three fourths inches. And at its tallest point, it is approximately a pinch under two and a half inches. And it can be yours for an absolutely steal of a deal for the low price of only $21 if you give me number two. Number two for $21 gets you this absolutely gorgeous purple and blue art glass dish. An absolutely gorgeous piece here. Congratulations to Steve, Back Alley Trash and Treasure. <laughs> Congratulations, Back Alley TNT, Steve Donomite. You are the winner, 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 purple and blue dinner. Congratulations and welcome back to the party. All right. Next up, we have this absolutely adorable cobalt blue basket. And look at the handles. I love the handles on this piece. Super awesome piece. I believe this is made by uh, Jigen Hart. Uh, they made a lot of these uh, toothpick uh, sort of things. And it does have this sort of cross emblem in the bottom of the basket. It is super awesome. And so at its tallest point... It measures to be about two and a quarter inches tall. And from handle to handle, it is three and a quarter inches. And it can be yours for an absolutely low price of only $11 if you give me number 27. Number 27 for $11 gets you this absolutely awesome, super detailed cobalt blue glass toothpick holder. Number 27 for Congratulations $11. to Tammy Renee Walker. 
Congratulations, Tammy Renee Walker, winner, winner, Kobo Blue Basket Dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. We're going to do some glow now because Sal has asked for it. All right. So first up um, is this Anchor Hawking, and it is a ribbed mixing bowl with the foot. I just love this. To, to me, it's one of the more awesome – uh, mixing bowl sets. Uh, this is one that goes into a mixing nesting bowl set. Uh, I just really like this uh, footed bottom here and it's ribbed. Um, and there are some utensil marks on the inside because once again, this was something that people used in a day-to-day -day basis back in the day. Um, and I'm going to turn off the lights because they are begging for the glow. And there she glows. Man, my, my battery is running dead. But you see it. Oh, it's a beaut. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. Just the, the, the lines on this, the way that it glows is crazy. Look at that. Yeah, Proud American. That was Tupperware before Tupperware was a thing. So this mixing bowl is, and another thing that's really cool too, is it does have this rolled edge, you know, you can put your, you can get up in there to grab it. And it is six and three fourths inches wide and three and a quarter inches tall. And this anchor hawking ribbed footed uh uranium glass <laughs> will it glow in the microwave uranium yeah, glass yeah. mixing bowl can be yours for the low price of only 13 dollars if you give me number three number three for 13 dollars gets you congratulations to bluegrass picker Congratulations, Bluegrass Picker. Winner, winner. Show your glow dinner. Congratulations, buddy, and welcome to the party. All right. Don't worry, Sal. You got one more, one more glowing item coming up tonight, bud. Next up, we have this absolutely gorgeous pink glass hen on nest. As you can see, it is that really pretty green shade. I mean, pink shade. <laughs> I want to say it's almost it's almost very similar to the pink potion bottle. And for those of you that don't know, it is a hen on nest, also known as a hun. So here. Is that little beads around inside there? That's nice coat. The glass is really different. Yeah, it is. It's, it's just, there's a lot of texture going on in this one. Very different. Unsure of who the maker is, but it is an absolutely beauty. I really like the head on this one. Like it's almost like a uh, like a donut as the head. It's pretty interesting. The eyes are interesting too. Very cool. <laughs> Uh, this one measures to be about four and a quarter inches wide, and at its tallest point, it is four inches, and it can be yours for an absolutely stunning low price of only $11 if you give me number 13. Number 13 for $11 gets you the pink glass hun, hen on nest. I don't know if you could fit 10 nuggets into that thing. Congratulations to Happy and Harned. Congratulations. Welcome to the party, Happy and Harned. Winner, winner, pink glass, hand on nest dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. We'll pick up the pace a little. Next up, we have... These absolutely gorgeous Westmoreland milk glass candle sticks. 
Uh, the name of this pattern is called Doric. This is the Doric pattern. They are marked Westmoreland glass on the inside down here. And I love just like the lines of the holes on the base here, the, the hollow torso here, absolutely fabulous. Mm -hmm. So you get the both candlesticks, you get the pair. So these candlesticks measure to be about four and a half inches tall, and you can have the pair of Westmoreland glass Doric pattern milk glass candlesticks for an absolutely low price of only $13 if you give me number 15. Number 15 for $13 gets you the pair of Westmoreland glass Doric milk glass candlesticks. It's like a flying candlestick. <laughs> Only $13 for the pair. Congratulations to Happy and Hearted. Congratulations, Happy and Hearted. You are the winner, 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 milk glass dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. <clears throat> Next up is another one of my favorite pieces of the evening. Here we have an absolutely stunning purple glass flask shape vase decanter. Absolutely gorgeous purple glass. The lighting is just does not even do it justice. I mean, this thing is like in the light, gorgeous purple. I mean, I wish I could, like, I wonder if I could flash the light through it this way. Ooh, it can. I mean, it is just a gorgeous purple. Absolutely stunning. Look at that, guys. And? And it is Daisy and Button is the pattern on the piece. And I believe it is made by uh, Clevenger Brothers. <laughs> and apparently there's still water in it from when we cleaned it. Okay, I was worried. My <laughs> Dukes finds it to be extremely funny. If you guys cannot hear her stop laughing. <laughs> <laughs> and it measures to be about five and three fourths inches tall. And it can be yours for the low price of only $19 if you give me number seven. Number seven for $19 for the purple glass Daisy and Button Clevenger Brothers flask vase. Oof. Congratulations to Sue. It is yours. Congratulations, Sue. You are the winner, 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 Purple Daisies and Buttons Dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. <clears throat> All right. Next up, we have this absolutely gorgeous mini lusterware, copper lusterware pitcher. Uh, get it to focus. And it is gorgeous. The neck almost is like a mother of pearl in, in sorts right around here. And then you have like this very beautiful pink. And it's got the silver swirl going around there. And, of course, the copper luster around the edge and the handle and the base. And this one is marked uh, Lancaster and Sandland, as you can see on the bottom. Is it numbered? Yes. Cindy, yes, I did get your information, I believe. All right. And this little guy measures to be two and a quarter inches tall, and it can be yours for the low price of only $11 if you give me number nine. Number nine for $11 gets you this miniature copper luster wear pitcher Made in England, an absolutely stunning piece. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Congratulations to Nancy Duke. 
Nancy, you are the winner. Congratulations, Nancy Duke. Winner, winner, copper, luster, dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. I think this might be my favorite thing of the entire night. Boom. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, you haven't even seen this yet, have you? Nope. I guess Josie didn't watch my video. No. Nope. He... <laughs> Been working. This is an absolutely stunning piece of Art Deco lusterware in absolutely fabulous condition and colors and imagery galore. I mean, it is an absolute beaut. Watch out for water. And it is made in Japan. And that is the same marking. So that marking is for Tashiro Shoten, who is the, the company behind this absolutely gorgeous Art Deco lusterware vase. And it's just, it's, I mean, it's hard to even describe how beautiful this piece is. You just don't see these sort of pieces in this sort of condition. Um, that have lasted this long and are that beautiful. It's amazing. So the vase measures to be seven and a quarter inches tall. And I'm gonna give you guys a steal of a deal. I hope you guys are ready for this. Get your fingers ready because this is steal of a deal. Only $17 if you give me number one. Number one for seventeen dollars gets you the Choshiro Shoten, made in Japan, Japanese Art Deco lusterware vase. Congratulations to Steve, back alley trash and treasure. Congratulations, Steve! You are the winner, winner, winner. Art Deco Japan luster dinner. Congratulations and welcome back to the party. All right, next up we have this adorable gold mid-century modern. Now, it does have some floral designs on there. I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not. Not yet. Pull it back a little It's just not focusing tonight, but there is a faint floral pattern on the gold. Now, it is possible that these were made by Pearl China Company, um, but I'm not 100% sure because the gold does go all the way around. So there is no marking on these pieces, uh, but they are a really adorable sugar and creamer set. And it can be yours for the low price of only $9 if you give me number 16. Number 16 for $9 gets you the individual sugar and creamer gold set. Absolutely awesome. Super mid-century modern. Congratulations to Christina Ganaskowski. Ganaskowski? I hope I said it right. <laughs> I thought you had it down pat by now. I thought so too. <laughs> Shoot, you can't talk. You messed up on I think it was <laughs> it was Susan's name. You said Susan Wehi and it's Susan Way. Way, okay. I got I got, got me. My bad. Congratulations, Christina. You are the winner. Winner, winner. Gold dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. Next up, we have a camel. It's not hump day, but it's a camel planter. This is a very awesome and unique camel planter. Um, it is made in Japan. As you can see the marking on the bottom, as soon as it decides to focus, there it goes. Very unique. It has this sort of maroon, burgundy sort of top here. And 
It's going bald on the top, but he does have hair on the sides. <laughs> <laughs> Very unique, and it is a planter, as you can see. What's the bottom? I showed the bottom already. Uh, I missed it. You did. All right. At its tallest point, this camel planter is four and a half inches. <laughs> Susan said it's better than we he. <laughs> no, the best is when Christina was like basically my whole life. I love the scared look people get sometimes when they try to pronounce it. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, so this absolutely awesome camel planter made in Japan can be yours for the low price of only $13 if you give me number four. Number four for $13 gets you the camel planter. Congratulations to Christine. Congratulations, Christine. Winner, winner, planter dinner. Congratulations and welcome to the party. All right. Up next, we have this awesome little barrel jug beer mug made by uh, probably Hazel Atlas. And it is a toothpick holder. And it is absolutely gorgeous. Once again, it has the paneling and parts of that paneling are textured. Really gorgeous color. This sort of like caramelized sugar honey color. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, this toothpick holder measures to be two and a half inches tall. And it can be yours for the low price of only $9.00. If you give me number 10, number 10 for $9 gets you the beer mug barrel toothpick holder. <laughs> yeah, you could use it as a shot glass, I suppose. Oh, yeah. Number 10, $9 for the amber glass beer mug. Over time. All right. Next up, we have this uh, horse head wall hanging thing. So here it is the horse head, as you can see. If it'll focus. There it goes. Very detailed painting of the horse. You can see the eyes. Now you can also see that there is a little bit of wear to the paint. I don't know if that's – it's not like necessarily wear. I think it's just – I think it's, I think it's part of the horse. No, uh, I think the, the, the paint from inside here dripped on to the horse's nose when they were I making see. it. Yeah. And there is one small little flake right there, as you can see. But besides that, it is in great condition. And that is the back. So I suppose you could hang it right there or mm -hmm. you could lay it flat. I mean, there's a lot of possibilities on how you can do that. But it is an absolute – I just love the detail of the horse's face. Like to me, it's just really well done in the eyes. Um, it measures to be – Five inches wide by five inches, and it can be yours. It's a pal palomino. Palomino. What? Palomino. Palomino. <laughs> she corrected you. I mean, geez, my dukes. It it's can a be yours for a low price of only $9 if you give me number 23. Number 23 for $9 gets you this absolutely awesome Palomino horse wall hanging thing. 
Congratulations. Oh, sorry. Congratulations to White Barn Thrift. I'm sorry. My internet is slow. Okay. <laughs> so even if I wanted to win an item, I would lose. It's not it's not your fault. It's like I, my mom is whispering it before you said it. So like in my natural yes. reaction, you just whispered. Yeah. So like my just natural, whisper. You hear me whisper that. No, but I'm not saying that they heard you. It's just my natural reaction is to say congratulations. Winner, winner. Hanging on the wall dinner because I don't want to say horse dinner. All right. Next up, we have this um, 1976 Declaration of Independence Blue Bell. Now, I'll tell you what's really interesting is that I'm going to go out on a limb and say that this is a possibility – that the dinger that's in here is not original because it's almost like it's metal. Oh, what is an ashtray? What's an ashtray? This. See the oh, thing? man. <laughs> What's going on? The horse is an ashtray. Stop playing. Oh. Yeah. That's what Tree S. Me said, too. And then I, looked I didn't and even think said, about that. Tree S. Me mentioned it, and I looked. I told <laughs> it's been a long three days. Thank you. It is an ashtray. How much is shipping? It depends on where you live. We are shipping from the state of Maryland. <laughs> um, but we do our best to make sure we keep our shipping costs as low as possible. Uh, that makes it cooler. Yeah. I, I can't believe I missed that. Yep. Nah, it's been yep, yep. Uh, Casey Attic says that uh, me and you need couples therapy. Oh, man. Ma Dukes. There's not enough money or time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he said that me and you need couples therapy. <laughs> <laughs> so this blue bell from uh, Declaration of Independence, I guess the 200-year anniversary or whatever, 1776 to 1976. What I really like about this bell is the beaded handles. Hmm. Super awesome. Uh, so the bell measures to be pinch under six inches tall, and it can be yours for the low price of only nine dollars if you give me number 14. Number 14 for the awesome aqua marine blue belt. Yes, the handle is rad. Trius me, number 14 for nine dollars. Congratulations to Tammy Renee Walker. Congratulations, Tammy. Tim just needs to listen to his mama. I do listen to her. That's mm. what gets me in trouble half of the time. Mm. <laughs> All right. Next up is a absolutely awesome piece. So this is a butter pat or a coaster or a <laughs> Josie pick this out yes i have i actually have sold a bunch of these previously in the live sale and on um our ebay and etsy store so they are made by pear point glass company um so they technically refer to them as cup trays um but they can be used as a multitude of different things and if you look on the inside the motif is an eagle um the piece itself measures to be three and a half by three and a half and yes ladies and gentlemen it is time to show your glow that's why i picked it look at how well, i gotta turn this light off this bad boy is like Yikes. yeah this one is is absolutely crazy with the glow you want to know what else is crazy? I picked it up knowing that it would glow without a flashlight. Well, yeah, I know you did. I don't know. My dude was asking me the whole time. She was like, does Josie have a flashlight? I was like, no, she's she's about 90% sure all the time. Those laser eyes can see the glow. There's something that Josie will, you know, mess like everybody else, like myself. But she got this one right. <clears throat> So here you go. Pearpoint Glass Company, Vaseline Glass, American Eagle. 
can be yours for a stunning low price of only $13 if you give me number six. Number six for $13 gets you the Pearpoint Glass Company Vaseline Glass Cup Tray Butter Pat Coaster Dish Thing. Number it's a two. lucky number. Six. Do we have a winner? Oh, yeah. Steve, congratulations. Back Alley Trash and Treasures. It's yours. <laughs> All right. You want to do overtime, babe? Yes, sir. All righty. Let's go back in time. So I want to go to number 11, the Hazel Atlas Coal Bucket. Please show me this cool green coal bucket could be yours. For how much? $9. $9 if you give me number 11. I think they're cute. Oh, very cute. I don't know. Something about it. Number 11 for the Hazel Atlas Coal Bucket in green. What kind of green is it? Avocado. Is it really avocado? Yeah. Okay. We can put that aside then. Now, last but not least, the Amber Beer Glass Toothpick Holder. Number 10 can be yours for $9. Just use it as a shot glass. I would do that. Why not? Number 10. All right. I think that concludes our sale. Yes. Yes, it does. So we'll, we'll put the... Uh... We'll put those back and bring them back maybe at a, a lower cost for the next one. But let me bring Josie back in the mix. <laughs> I've got people all over in the this house. The descriptions sound way cooler from Josie. Oh, <laughs> so sweet. So uh, I want to thank everybody, as always, for – Joining us for tonight's live vintage sale, we can't appreciate it more than you know. We wouldn't be able to do this without you guys. Um, don't forget that next Monday we will be starting earlier than usual because it is a longer sale and it is going to be our official fundraising wedding sale. So we're super excited. We're going to have a lot of good stuff and we're going to um, – try and give you guys some previews during the week as well as our typical preview. Yeah. Um, also, if uh, you we don't have your information, make sure you send your information to the email address that is scrolling across the bottom of the screen. Um, don't forget to hit the thumbs up as always. Um, then there was something else I was going to say too. I can't well, remember. let's just let them know that the time that we're going to begin. The Seven. Yeah, so 7 on the dot. Instead of 8 o'clock, we're going to start at 7 p.m. Eastern time. Yep. Okay. How many items are we going to do? 40? At least 40. Yeah, 40 items. So even if you can't make it on time, I'm sure that you'll be able to join us at you know, 8. But try your best. Yeah, and it will be um, straight. Half of it will be straight pricing and half of it will be auction style. So it's going to be a little bit different than it is normally. Um, but definitely want to thank you guys for all the love and support, all the super chats, um, yeah. all the people that have bought us coffee, um, which the link for that is in the description as well. Don't forget to, um, to check out the three haul videos that we put out. And remember, if there's something that you guys see in that video, just send, uh, put a comment in underneath the video and we will add that to the live sale. So mm -hmm. thank you guys as always. We really appreciate it. Make sure you guys go check out um, Patrick, uh, Trusty Huxer Mercantile. He is live right now on with uh, Misty and the rest of the gang, Vintage Rescue Squad. Uh, so make sure you guys head over there. Go over to there into the chat. Tell them that Tim and Josie from over the years sent you guys. And uh, enjoy the rest of your night. 
Thank you, as always. We really appreciate it. And we'll see you guys soon. Peace. Bye.